Hello brother and sisters in Christ. Wakeman here. Today's message is in recognition and gratitude for our true heroes in our world. Heroes who have struggled to recover from narcissist abuse and are sharing their lessons learned to inspire other victims to heal and recover from the unhuman abuse. There are also heroes fighting against the beast system to expose the deceptions and the current narcissistic agenda to keep people in bondage. There are also heroes facing brutal prosecution for proclaiming the word of God and inspiring people to repent from their sins and come out of the Babylonian beast system through Jesus Christ. These are the heroes of our time. However, let us not forget the heroes who are no longer with us and have created means and resources for other fellow brave people to march towards freedom for all. These are heroes gone, but not forgotten. In this regard, I've learned about Michael Hampton, a narcissist abuse survivor who may not have the chance of sharing his journey through his recovery. However, he left a special gift for three channels which are exposing the truth about narcissist abuse and recovery. Mr. Hampton was a free-spirited man, prone to daydreaming and thinking more than other people, with a lot of determination to follow through with what he believed in. A future outside the walls of narcissist abuse. May we all remember our true heroes, and join our hearts and prayers, for those, still, with us, and for those, already gone. They are the true image of what I say, united we stand, divided we fall, because together, we heal. In remembrance of Michael Hampton, a hero gone, but not forgotten. God bless you. Please, remember. Jesus Christ is the truth, the way, and the life.